figure that would ha that that the last part would actually finish without giving that shout out. So let's hope giving a shout out would actually work this time. So let's go ahead and go to Smiki's bonus bonanza. Guys, ready for that final question? This is actually pretty insane. What was the name of this area of the island? No, to no one's surprise. What was the name of the old man Kong who lives in a monkey museum? That's actually what the place is actually called. It's cranky. And a zinger for Watts. Now it's on to Castle Challenge. What was the name of the castle? What was the rising floor? That would be Castle Crush if you remember from the last part. You would think it would be six, but no, it's actually five. If you actually counted the counted Squawk's cousin, which I'm still not sure about yet. His name is Cloak. You guys are ready for this. Big egg bounty. Yes, that is the question everyone was ready for. <laughs> no, Squitter. Okay, this one I actually know because I go to court and gets five. How many different bats do you think are in the game? That means in total. Think about that for a moment. You do not think you'd be asked this question. And you want to know what the answer to that is? It's actually 30. I actually somehow got that right first try. And it only took a guess. That's all. We're done with Swanky now. Now, if you think you can go back and do them again, you can't. That's that's pretty much it. You only get to do them once. So now let's head to Toxic Tower. Now, this level used to scare me as a kid because, because there's the acid there. Now, you get to be chased by acid, and if you touch it, good luck getting out of that. Like, seriously. If you touch it, you're pretty much done. You're pretty much dead. So now, let's actually do this. Now, you, you just have to worry about getting to the top. Thankfully, there's only one bonus room we have to get. And it's not that hard to get, too. So, well, there's, of course, the DK coin, which is actually just down here. If you're fast enough, you can get it, go up, and then continue on without any worry. Ooh. That was really, really risky. Ooh. 
Come on! There we go. Now we just fly. Just fly. So now you don't really have to worry about it much except getting hit by everything. <laughs> Seriously, this is actually one of those levels that used to terrify me as a kid. No joke. Like, would you be very scared if you had acid chasing you? Think about that. Now we have Squitter here. And he's needed for this, here. Just up here. There we go. That's fine with the token. Now you want to be very careful. Seriously. Potentially got hit there. Nope. All right, now we're at the end of the level, actually. And go down. Just go over here. Then a green balloon right there, just waiting for you. But you have to lure it first. Lure the acid. It's obvious we're not going to fight the boss, because, seriously, if you, if you remember last episode, Ringley had no advice for the boss here, because, it's Tony Cloud! And he's, and yeah, he just gets taken away. To the flying croc. But first, Screech's sp sprint. Now, remember the Cattle Nine Tails? Yeah, they come back. Now you get to see them more often. Like, much more. At this point of the game. Like, they're seriously the bane of your existence. And also, that banana's there for. I might have to check off screen. Now, do not run past them, because there's another one waiting for you. Because if you run past them and try to jump over this guy, well, the other one's still alive. You're gonna lose your buddy. Ooh. Yeah, because you need buddy for this. Let's find the token. And you need Dixie for this one. Alright. Now you can just drop. Because it won't use the ditty. Drop and done. Now, there's only one more cram coin we have to get, and thankfully, it's at the end of the game. Go ahead. Now, it's what we have to do race and screech. I remember how much I hated this. It's actually 
it used to be so hard for me to do. But now, it's actually not that bad anymore. Ooh, as I get hit. Wait a minute, there's something over here. Good thing I remember this. Don't worry, you have lots of time to beat him. He's actually pretty slow. Stand corrected. No, never mind. And there we go. Oh. And done. That's the first time you get a green balloon as a prize. Funky and Wrigley are here. Not cranky. Now it's time for the final battle. Ooh, man. Shot him three times. Anyway, this is Captain K. Rule. He is pretty much a joke. All you have to do is shoot the cannibal into his... What kind of gun do you think that is? I actually don't know. We're going to call it a cannonball gun. Sure, why not? for that one. Anyway, you just throw the cannonball into his gun when he's, well, pulling you into his gun. And then just throw it. Simple. And there's three different phases, phases of this boss. You have to hit him, hit him nine times. Changes up his strategy each hit. Like I said, he's a joke. Until you get to the last phase. Whoa! Yeah, by the way, each shot gets faster. And by the way, do not let him clip you into his gun. Because if you're close enough, he will hit you with, hit you with said gun. So be very careful. And boom. Yeah, apparently it can also shoot barrels. Just like how cannons, cannon can. That shoot cannons. Okay, I had to bring that back. I'm sorry. Dixie, in this part, is make this a joke. Oh yeah, by the way, he has the power to do, go invisible. Somehow. Where he learns of that, I don't even know. Actually, he could learn that Bowser. Oh. You do not want those to touch you. They have different effects. I can't remember what all of them were. I know one of them is freezing, inverted controls. There's, and I think one of them slows you down as well. Future Steve, please, please correct me on this. Oh, there's the inverted controls. Purple does inverted controls. Everyone's favorite en worst enemy. For the controls. Come on, Dixie. Come on, Dixie. Don't fail me. Ooh. And that is it. 
Dixie saves the day. Nah, I'm only kidding. It's Donkey Kong. Just punches him through the roof and into the swamp. That is some serious power. Like, seriously. Anyway, Frankie is going to thank us. Rescue that lazy grandson of mine and dump K. Rool in his own filthy swamp. Not bad for a novice. Of course, if I'd have been playing, I'd have made sure that K. Rool never tries to cheat and trick like this again. I reckon I'd, I'd found all the cram coins and completed the so called Lost World. Oh, oh well, can't expect everything from your first game, can we? One more thing, how many of my special video game hero coins did you find? Real players such as myself would have found plenty, I'm sure. Let's see how well you did, eh? And here's Kirk's second screen. And it shows it. Well, I've got a second screen and it's about time too. Now shut up everyone while I read the equally weighted results as my prestigious Video Game Hero Awards. Hey, not bad for a youngin. Of course you're gonna have to find a few more if you want to be a big hero as I was. If you want to look or lift the progress of the screen, press the top left and right buttons while you are on any of the map screens. Now buzz off and see if you can find some more of my coins, which I very much doubt you will. Come at me, Cranky! And that is it! There's actually still more to this game. Unlike Donkey Kong Country. Now, we have to go through the Lost World. That's right, the Lost World. A world that was not in the first game. Not quite done. And this is actually the toll bridge. So we finally get to see what it looks like before we get to freaking Clubba. Yeah, you can tell it has Diddy Kong's face right there, not a picture of K. Rool. Lot Sam, that's his name. There's Shuri. What the? There's Lockjaw, and then there's another Lockjaw that I can't remember his name. Oh, Snapjaw. His name is Clapon. Okay. There's these assholes. Yeah. Anyway, that's yeah. That's it until we get to the Lost World. That might be the last, the final episode. I'm not sure. There's actually. There's Clubba. Barnacle Bosses. Cleaver. Sword. That's Cudgel. Yeah. 
They don't even show show the ghost crow because we pretty much just got got rid of him from existence. Actually, I did notice that until now. Wow. All this go by, and I'll see you all next time when we take on the Lost World. So, thank you all very much for watching this video. Like, I really, like, it really means to me because I really love these games. Like, since I was a, a kid. Like, yeah. I just love them. Next time. See you all next time. This is my fan twenty. The potatoes. Goodbye, guys. Hey, what are you waiting for? There's right now some stuff hidden here, Sonny. There is, however, a couple special features on the game. Select the page. Though I'm sure they're of little use. If you find these silly often, first down lots of times, but if I were you, I wouldn't bother. Now switch this cartridge off and let me get some sleep. I reckon I've earned it. <laughs>